So Bella Dora tu is saying, what are the signs that someone has been manipulated into a cult and how do you get them out? Well, so Bella Dora tu, I would suggest this book written by America's leading cult expert, Dr. Stephen Hassan, um, called Combating Cult Mind Control. He has a fantastic um, model that he uses to help illustrate how you know if someone has um, joined a destructive organization. And um, it's called the BITE model, in all caps, if you want to look that up. And basically, the signs are the degree to which a ideology or organization or community exerts control over the individual, control in their behavior, their emotions, their thoughts, um, and uh, the information that they are allowed to receive and go seek out. Um, a good, an amazing way to tell if something is a destructive organization is to see what happens to someone when they try to leave an organization. That is one of the telltale signs that of how toxic a ideology or a community can be, is what happens when someone tries to leave. Will they be excommunicated? Will they be disfellowshipped? Will they be ostracized? Will they be abused? Will there be, there be, will there be threats against their life? Will they be stalked? Will there, will there be physical abuse against them? Will there be coercion to get them back in? Um, all those things are um, real red flags about a destructive organization. And you asked, how do you get them out? Um, again, I would really look into the work of Dr. Stephen Hassan. Um, if you don't want to read his whole book, he has a YouTube channel that I really like. Um, look for the YouTube channel Freedom of Mind. Um, and you can look at a lot of information. He talks about this often. He has an entire book dedicated to getting people out. Although he also talks about it in this book. Um, and um, it's uh, it's like way too much in depth for me to get into right here. So I would just um, really refer to you to his channel. Or if you, so this book is more meant for like ordinary people. Um, but if you want to get really into the weeds of it, this is written by a um, psych uh, psychiatrist, Robert J. Lifton, Thought Reform in the Psychology of Totalism. This is the seminal book on brainwashing, studying people who survived um, uh, Chinese communist indoctrination. Um, and this is like really where it's at. But this is a little bit more hefty. Um, a lot of people don't know that the term brainwashing actually comes from Chinese to describe what the communists would do to people. Um, so yes, this is a huge area of interest for me and I'm glad you asked. Hey guys, if you're a fan of blasphemy and sexy Cali, you know, like me, then you need to be sure to subscribe to our newsletter, link in the description below. Because if you subscribe, we will send you a free copy of our Blasphemous Art ebook. And let me tell you, it is the tastiest blasphemy that you can find anywhere available today. And we are so generous with our blasphemy that we continue to send you more blasphemy every week. So make sure to subscribe. Link in the description below.